let's find the radius and interval of convergence for the following series. And we recognize this is a power series because we can write it as follows. And now we check for absolute convergence using the ratio test. So we take the absolute value of the ratio of the next term in the series to the current term in the series. And we take the absolute value because x can be negative, and the ratio test applies only if this ratio is positive. And I'm doing a bit of algebra, and given that n is positive, and the first term evaluates to x, so we can take the absolute value of x outside the limit. And with these factorials, all terms cancel, except n plus 1 in the denominator. So this can be written as follows. And therefore the limit evaluates to 0. So by the ratio test, rho is always less than 1. So that means the series converges for all values of x. So effectively, the radius of convergence is infinity, and the interval of convergence is minus infinity to infinity.